Okay, I'm back. So here is spot number one. Not really sure what it is. Might be dirt. Feels a little sticky. Touch it. Get a little resistance. And um, here is spot number two. Okay, you see that? Yep. And here is spots number three. So looks like it's just children's crayons marker or something like that. I'm not really sure. But we're going to uh going to get it up with my handy dandy brush. Soft brush. Well it's kind of medium, not very soft. And I'm just gonna spray. If you don't mind, I might, you know, I'm just gonna for sake of time I'm gonna pause the video. But you you guys know what it looks like to pray spray uh pre spray. So, um, I'll just be right back, okay? All right. Okay, I'm back. So, I laid down the pre-spray. It's been dwelling for about a minute or two, maybe three. Just want to use my brush to agitate. So, we tested out earlier. And it seemed to be working. Go to spot number three. Three. All right, we'll pause the video. I'll be right back to steam it out. All right, YouTube, I'm back. Um, I went ahead and made a more concentrated 
form. I went. I used the old Gatorade bottle because when I tested it out, it just came up. That's way too much. See that spot gone? Let's go ahead and do it over here. Give it a good old Nike shuffle. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and see if these will come out better. I don't know. I really don't think these uh, purple spots will come out. Let's see what happens. I mean, they're fading. That's good. Shit. A little too much. That's why I made a big bottle of it. Yeah, good old Nike shuffle. Yeah, it's fading. That's a good thing, I guess. I said I had to go and get a more concentrated version. And what I did was I took about the same amount I put in the gallon, but I put it out here. So about three ounces of OSR. But I didn't use that much degreaser. I probably used about two ounces of degreaser. Maybe, maybe that. Definitely an ounce. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and start extracting. This color stuff needs to come out. All right, let me go ahead and start extracting and see what happens. I mean, it looks a lot better. I still kind of see it. It's got to look really close. But still, I didn't have to do any kind of like 
heat extraction or heat absorption technique or anything like that. Just straight pre-spray. And that's the meaning of this video. So that, hey, you got a good pre-spray. You should be able to get some pretty tough spots out. So like, see, uh, let's look right here. a lot better remember how dark it was right here and look at that can't even tell Right, let's go to the last one over here. It's basically gone already. All right, this video is uh, getting pretty long, so I'm gonna go ahead and close it out. But yeah, here it goes. The uh, after. And it was really black right here, and. Uh, I'm going to go over this area one more time, but as you see, all the color spots pretty much gone. I haven't done right there yet, but um, let me go ahead and pause the video so you can see uh, the after shot. All right, through the magic of time, we are done. Just wanted to show the after. Remember, it was a lot of color spots in this area. And just want to show that the OSR really does affect, you know, any kind of stings that can be oxidized out. Like I said, if you look really close, you can see some color left. But you got to look really, really close, like right there. I think right there is a blue little dot right there. You can see it. But other than that, it looks 110% better. And like I was saying, no, no, uh, what do they call that? The iron, when they use the iron, the heat extraction, somebody put in the comment, comment section, what method I'm talking about when, you know, you extract the, the stains, the color dye stains out with the iron and a, a white cloth. I don't know why my brain is not working, but, uh, yeah, check this out. I mean, it looks a whole lot better. Let's go to spot number two over here. Ta-da! Not even there. And everything right here came up too. Look from this angle. And then the final one, when you first walked in, this one right here. Remember it was all black right here? Now that could have been dirt, you know. As soon as you walk in, it's the high traffic area. But yeah, just go ahead and uh, leave a like if you think I did a good job. And uh, we see you in the next video. Thank y'all so much for watching. Sorry so long. I know I wanted this video to be three minutes long, and then now it's 14 minutes long. Okay, then. See you in the next video.